away people and welcome back to fake card friday so i know this card is simple it's not that good a creation but i had to review it because it's just so funny because it works so well with our of course january 2015 banlet so today we are looking at a fake card called re-equip so clearly it's just a picture of a seatbelt like you couldn't have found something better than that. Like that that's a really, really sad image. And of course that image looks way too realistic to ever be on a Yu-Gi-Oh card like that. Like it's just like that's really sad. It's really sad. You would you do? Just Google search seatbelt and just slap it in there as a picture, like eh, whatever. It is a quick play spell. It is from Legendary Collection Joey's World. Like, why Legendary Collection Joey's World? Like, okay, I guess. <laughs> But uh, anyway, uh, let's go ahead and read this card, and uh, you guys will probably have a freaking aneurysm if this card ever exists. So, your equip says, target one equip spell in the graveyard, add that target to your hand. Ah, so valid. So, so good. Yes, yes. That's, I, think, I, think, I think that's fair. I totally think that's fair. <laughs> you guys are probably like, your eyes, your eye is twitching right now. You're like, oh, oh, did you just say that I could get Snatch Steel back again for, you know, yeah. Yeah, you know, this person totally decided to be this guy. And the funny thing is, he made it after the ban list was confirmed. After the ban list. Like, you know, I, on the Yu-Gi-Oh card maker forums, you know, you put your card, you get some feedback. And people were just in their blah, like, Wiss, we snatch it? You know what the guy replied with? I don't know what snatch deal is. Like, damn. Like, I get that snatch deal has been banned for a long time. A long time. I'd at least say about, you know, 10 years plus, I think. It's been banned for a long time. But, uh, you know, to be, you know, so ignorant of this card's existence, you know, of the card's existence is just shocking, you know, like, you made this card and didn't even check out the ban list, like, you're just making cards and you don't even, you know, it seems like, you know, if you were going to make cards for the game, you'd know at least what the game holds, and one of the things that the game holds would at least be checking out the ban list, you know, so he, he the person who made this card made this card completely not knowing that Snatch Steel was even a card, let alone that it's not banned. So, does this card work? Well, of course, you know, just like how stupid with uh, Hidden Armory is, where, you know, you mill the car top card off your top of the deck, uh, and uh, you get an Eclipse Spell card from your deck or your graveyard, and then you can't normal summon or set this turn. You can just go ahead and get Snatch Steel right back from the graveyard. You know, you can just, and it, I don't know why it's a quick play spell, you know, why this card's a quick play spell, because, you know, even if it was a quick play spell, you know, it's not like you can, you know, you know, equip it during your opponent's turn. And that's the whole point of, you know, quick play spells that you can, you know, their spells speak too, and you can play them during your opponent's turn, you know? So I guess the best part of being a quick spell is you can have this card set, and then your opponent blind space, you can just like, oh, chain, requip, get my snatch steel back, but then you can't, you know, you can't equip it, you know? And if this card said, like, target one equip spell in the graveyard and then equip it to an appropriate target, then maybe I could see that, because then, you know, you could just, you know, during your opponent's turn, you know, they could do something, you could just be like, alright, um, you know, spell speed 2, re-equip, activate it, you know, target 1, equip spell in the graveyard, equip it to an appropriate target, equip it to your monster, snatch deal, gimme, you know, I could see that, but, you know, just to have a quick play spell card where you just add something back from your, your, uh, graveyard to your hand is kind of pointless, that's like, as if, uh, where you're turning alive with a quick play spell, it's like, why? Like, I don't know, why not? So I can change to something and my opponent can neg with a blind space, like, I guess. Anyway, of course, you can just go ahead and, uh, requip and, uh, get your snatch steel back. So, you know, uh, with requip, you would have, of course, snatch steel and three hidden armory and three swords at dawn and three magician of faith and three magic of stun activation and three requip. So, you know what? Just take my monster. You know what? I don't want it. Just take my fucking monster, you know? And, of course, in daily duels, you guys know I've been doing some stupid shit. I've got in both Cleveland and Shadows on daily duels. Well, actually, you guys don't know about that yet if you're actually watching that this you know, as soon as this video goes up, but yes, in Shadals for daily duels, you know, I'm running Nef Shadal Fusion, and Nef Shadal Fusion is a quick spell, so why not run, of course, Hidden Armory, and why not, of course, run Snatch Steel, so yeah, so, you know, on this card, if this card existed, it'd just be ridiculous, like I said, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if Konami did make, didn't make something like this, because Konami is high on some good drugs, like, sometimes I don't even know what Konami is thinking, but, uh, this guy, you know, this guy is just, it's just a case of just ignorance, you know, just, just oblivious to, uh, the fact that, uh, Snatch Deal is even a thing, you know. But there's just one more, this piece of resistance, this just that little, mmm, just delish about this card. Alright, so let me read it again, alright? Target one equip spell card in, not your, 
the graveyard the not yours the graveyard so you know you know if your opponent's not still your monster and you're salty and you want to get revenge just play requip and take their snatch steal from their graveyard and then equip it to their monster and take their shit like ridiculous they're ridiculous it's not your graveyard it's the graveyard so if your opponent you know use their snatch steal already just take their snatch steal and use it <laughs> ridiculous ridiculous like i said is there not enough taking in this world like huh so uh can we say in april uh that uh snatch steal gets rebanned <laughs> you know i get konami you, you want to unban every you get a card and see if it's broken or not but snatch steel is still broken especially since it's searchable and you can recycle it over and over and over and over. Like, it's still stupid. I'm sorry, Konami. It's dumb. It's dumb. I'm sorry. You think that it's not, but it is. So, yeah. It should probably get rebanned. You know? And I just, I just, just, you know, if Snatch Steel didn't get banned, I wouldn't even look at this Carpet Fight card. But just because of Snatch Steel, I had to just get a good, I had to give you guys a good chuckle. Or an aneurysm about just someone creating this card after the ban list has revealed. But, like I said, I didn't know about Snatch Steel, and I wonder if they're regretting even creating, thinking about creating this card with the existence of Snatch Steel. Ha, <sighs> ridiculous. Alright, so, tell me what you guys think about Requip and Snatch Steel in the comment section below. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Fake Card Friday. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys next Friday with another Fake Card to look at. Alright guys, thanks for watching.